over here at Montclair State where the Lions have just done it. They captured the NJAC Championship and penalties. Joining me now, Kendra Griffith, the hero for the Lions in goal, stopped that third mm -hmm. penalty kick. Actually got a break on the first one when it wasn't on frame, but uh, what was your thinking on that third shot? You just guessed right. Yeah, I did. Um, we, and there's always the option to go to one side the whole time, but I felt like I could read it. So I, I went where I, my instinct told me to go. In terms of the match itself, it was a great match. I mean, it was back and forth. They had chances. Uh, you had chances. There was a sequence right there in overtime where the ball just trickled wide. I mean, uh, just both teams got a couple breaks. Yeah. I mean, you can't take anything away from them. That was an awesome game. Um, we, we had to fight for it. There was no, it was no, they weren't rolling over for us, but I'm just happy we could do it um, in the end. So, yeah. It's turned into a pretty good rivalry. It I mean, has. I and Montclair, and give them credit. I mean, they really built their program, but Coach Russo referenced something when you guys were taking your picture about 16 championships right. in 20 years. How special is that tradition of TCJ soccer? It's so special. I mean, the NJAC is so important to us. We don't ever... Uh, like it's one of the toughest co conferences in the country, so we d we would never uh, look past the NJAC. It's uh, you know one of the toughest things we have to do every season, and but we just you know every season we have to uh, come up big and get it done. And coaches let us for many many years now. <laughs> when you take a, a match like this and you play one of the top teams in the country to a draw and then actually win in penalties. I mean, is this something you think you can build on going into the NCAAs, this kind of momentum? Absolutely, and I think we need to continue not letting any goals up in regular time, So we and we need to score some in regular time, but yeah, we definitely need to um, keep defending as a unit like we do, and I think this is just going to push us right into the NCAA tournament. Well, it was a game with two outstanding teams, two outstanding goal keepers, but one that actually came up with a key save and led her team to the penalty kick victory, Kendra Griffith. Congratulations. Thank you.